there's no processing on, on the recordings at all so what you got was just raw recordings didn't do nothing to the recordings so just put them straight into the video what's going on it's Casey welcome back to my channel hope you're well so today's video I'm going to be doing a review on the Comica VS08 microphone so it's for smartphones so if you're looking to upgrade your current microphone and you've got you on a budget maybe this mic will be a decent choice for you so I'm going to do a couple of tests test it against the camera test it against the microphone camera that I'm using now my iPhone and then we test the comical microphone as well just to see how it measures up against these other ones but first before I do that you know I've got to do my shout outs because I, I appreciate all my subscribers for clicking that subscribe button so shout out Adam Friedman and ST Mike 504 thank you both for subscribing I appreciate you both I hope you've hit the notification bell as well so you get notified for future videos favorite comment for this week's coming from dope Mikey beats bro thank you I appreciate the comment Glad that it's helped you, glad that I'm helping you and others. Um, like I always say, there's no point in me holding on to the knowledge. I gain absolutely nothing from holding knowledge. So yeah, always happy to help and share what I know so that you can be the best at what you do. Let's dive into this video. So here we've got the Comic Mic nicely boxed up. CVM VS08 directional con condenser shotgun video microphone for smartphone. So Android, iPhone users, iPad, tablet, if you want, you can plug it in there, hopefully get a decent sound. So this microphone can be used in all these different devices. So have a look inside the box. So neatly packaged. So we've got a nice pop filter. Stop the, the plosives and the S's. Maybe muffle the sound a little. We'll see how, how it sounds when we test it. Got the clip. This clip will fit onto your iPhone or your Android so to stop it from moving back and forth. Then we've got the microphone itself. Feels quite sturdy, made of metal. Well built, quarter inch jack. Fit that into your phone or your device, whatever you're using. Yeah, feels good. Nice finish on there. All good. So inside the box, we've got some instructions as well. A few different bits of bits of paper. Details probably to get your email address and stuff. And what else do we have in here? More bits of paper. More paper, and without tearing the box apart, we have a dead cap, as it's known as. So that there will you put that on the mic. That's ideal if you like to record outside and trying to reduce the sound of the wind. Then yeah, that's what you're going to use. We could test it out with and without and see if it makes makes much of a difference. This is the mic with nothing on, no windshield no uh no wind muff so i've got the wind muff on now uh, i don't know how much difference that's making if it's a big difference or uh, you can well it's not even that windy now either oh well so just using the mic from the iphone same street people walking about and stuff so yeah can you tell the difference so right now I'm using the microphone from the camera. I'm gonna switch over to the Comica microphone and see if you can notice when, if it's changed or made a difference. The microphone's roughly the same distance that it is with the camera. And I'm also gonna use the audio from just the iPhone to, just to see if it makes any, any difference. But at the moment, I'm in the studio. I've got treatment, room treatment. So there's not so much reverb, bit of a, a dead sound. But it'll be interesting to see how it sounds. I've actually switched over to the iPhone now, so how much of a difference does it make? Like I said, I mean, I'm in the studio right now, so the room's treated, so it might, might make a difference, it might not make a difference. How does it sound to you? Is it good? Could you tell the difference? So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna plug, I'm gonna plug the Comica mic back in and see how much of a difference it makes. So I've plugged the Comica mic back in, and yeah, what do you think? I'm gonna listen back to it now and draw a conclusion of what I think. I actually like how the microphone sounds. I mean, with the iPhone, 
can definitely tell when I was using that because obviously the, the iPhone isn't a directional mic whereas the Comica mic is a directional mic so I feel like the Comica gets rid of a lot of the surrounding sounds yeah just makes it makes the audio a lot cleaner also don't forget when you're using this mic to put your phone onto the edge so you don't get any interference coming through the microphone don't know if you noticed but when I was recording outside there was a lot of felt like there's a lot of dropouts I don't know if it's just because of the way I had the mic set up if you look at the mic here I've had to use an adapter because the, the mic's got a quarter inch jack and you know the iPhones they've got these lightning cable ports so that the workaround is a bit it's a bit of a fraff I think that's the only con that I found with this is just getting it stable so that you get decent recordings especially if you're recording outside if you're just recording indoors and you manage to make it stable then that's not really an issue but if you're recording outside then that might cause a problem using the adapter and trying to get it to, to sit right with the phone I'm actually going to use this mic a lot more often I like it I like how it sounds it made my voice a little bit deeper there's no processing on, on the recordings at all so what you got was just raw recordings didn't do nothing to the recordings so just put them straight into the video so drop a comment below let me know what you think what or your thoughts on the comica mic is it something that you'd probably consider buying or you would look for something else for me decent I like it hope you enjoyed this video I hope you got something from it if you've got any questions hit me up on insta I'm always happy to help like this video at all hit the like button hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you get notified anytime I put up a new video as per usual I appreciate your time Thank you.